the adult person is supposed to eat between 25 to 35 grams of fiber per day. And I'm gonna look at which of these foods has the most fiber in for the least amount of food that you have to eat. So my name's Anita and I'm second year in postgrad in functional nutrition. And I would have thought, looking at it, that this big bowl of lettuce leaves, 100 grams, would actually have more fibre in it than, say, a banana or some rolled oats or even a small 15 gram portion of chia seeds. Well, you are in for a surprise because this big bowl of lettuce leaves only contains 1.6 grams of fibre. So before I jump into which one of these is the most fibrous, let's talk about what fibre does for your body. So fibre actually is the cornerstone of removing all of the waste products from our body. Fibre usually travels through the stomach and into the small intestine and out of the large intestine and takes with it all the toxins and things that our body doesn't need and bulks up our stool. Now fibre actually feeds our gut biome as well. So inside our gut we have lots and lots of different bacteria working really hard to break down the food that we eat and help our body to absorb the nutrients and remove the stuff we don't want. The gut biome actually eats fibre as an energy source and converts that to what's known as short chain fatty acids, which are really beneficial to our human health. But if we think that one whole plate of lettuce leaves is going to give us enough fibre, then what are we doing wrong? Well, let's have a little look at some other things we might think has a lot of fibre. This plum, for instance, weighs around 50 grams and only actually has less than one gram of fibre in it. Whereas this banana, which is a medium size, actually has 3.2 grams of fibre on average. So having a banana over a plum is definitely something to consider. Another thing to consider is your breakfast. Now, if you had 40 grams of rolled oats, you're going to be actually having 3.6 grams of fibre. And if you top that rolled oats off with a small 15 gram portion of chia seeds, you're going to be adding a whopping 4.9 grams of fibre. And better still, if you thought about having a breakfast that consisted of 40 grams of rolled oats, 15 grams of chia seeds, and a medium sized banana, you're looking at, on average, having between 10 and 12 grams of fibre in just one meal. That's 12 times more than having a whole plate of lettuce leaves. If you have any questions about why fibre is so important and what fibre can do for your body, then drop them in the comments and I'll be sure to answer them as soon as possible. And don't forget to smash that follow button because I really, really appreciate it.